with the big punches or he wants to be at range landing kicks. He's just constantly putting damage on you. Top, bottom, up, low, it does not matter. This guy is a dominant striker. One of the best kickboxers the UFC has ever seen. And in terms of the punching technique and the jab, as good as anyone in this division. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. Now for the official Ladies introductions, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffett. The main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the O2 Arena in London, England. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer. Making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Bazooka. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. It's usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is, and this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Lee gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. That right hand landed. Oh, nice. Nice. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. And take down. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Work that right. Lee going for the body, missed with that kick. And he landed the right hand there. Well, missed on that one. Head kick. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Just over three minutes now to go in round one. Try to establish that jab. Under three minutes remain in round one. 
getting loaded up on that right hand, too. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Oh, that's big. Nice leg kick lands. He's giving him so many different things right now. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. <laughs> Trying to establish that jab once again. Lands a right hand out of that exchange. Slips to avoid the right. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Oh, nice jab. Oh, he lands a huge knee to the body. That's a crippling shot there. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. There's no give on that leg kick. Not there. Good punch. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful nice. kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. All right, well, the crowd enjoyed those five minutes. DC, take us through some of the highlights from that previous one. Face punching at its best. Ha. He loaded it up, he threw it straight, threw it long, and over and over, that punch found the target. It allowed him to really dictate the pace of that round. All right, next round is underway, and how about the head movement and the slips? Really a beautiful defensive effort to watch in that previous round. It looked as if he was training in his boxing ring with the two ropes spread across. There's, there's a jump rope on one end going to the other end of the boxing ring and another one making the X in the middle, and you're just working on your head movement. His ability to see everything reminds me of a guy that's learning to do that drill. That is... Oh, man, this dude is good. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. Here. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may throw the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Right hand upstairs. Oh. Massive head kick. Lee's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. Just unable to quite find that range. Lance with the right hand. Nice. 
Well, he's got a pretty good sidekick, and you saw it right there. He did it great, and it pushed his opponent back. Notice how it creates space and allows him to get back to where he's coming. Big kick lands. We march on three minutes to go. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, man, that couldn't have felt good. Flush knee lands to the body by the taller fighter. Big punch lands through the middle. Back and forth we go here. Nice leg kick there by Lee. Slips the punch. Nice one, two there. Oh, uppercut to the head, but it's blocked there by Lee. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Good stick. Big head kick lands. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, just misses. Let's go, set the pace. You set the pace. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. All right, throws a straight punch and lands, so that is increasingly becoming an effective weapon for him tonight. This is one of his best strikes, and he's throwing it over and over again. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Oh, and he lands yet another flush knee. That's going to leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not-too-distant future. Maybe a cut to the left of the nose. Lee gets caught with that punch. 15 seconds to go. Real sneaky body kick. Goes to the body there. Two rounds in the books. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent, and as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Let's go, I need you to be first now. Just missing on the uppercut there. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Dig and kick. Oh, yeah, right here. Beautiful punch. He lands the head kick. Big leg kick land. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Oh, 
Look at the force behind that leg. Right hands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Went for the inside leg kick. Beautiful strike. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. The issue with that kick, as effective as it is, one gets checked, you have the Anderson Silva situation. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Body kick is blocked. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Ooh, what a punch. Right hand upstairs. Real nice body kick lands. So the taller fighter lands a knee yet again. Oh, and there's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Lee. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Canvas cleanup guy's gonna be busy. Keep your hands up. Nice defense there, huge block. Nice straight punch. Oh, man, look how quickly he gets that foot to the target. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's going to hurt this opponent. He blocks the punch. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Effective punch there by Lee. Watch knees to the body. Oh, that right hand is on point. Big kick lands. And they separate. Pretty good right hand. Drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. He lands flush with that right hand. All right, so a big round for him there. Maybe even a 10-8. There was a big knockdown in there, courtesy of the kick. DC, talk us through it. He found his spot. I mean, he knew that there was a weakness. He found the spot. He recognized an opportunity to go and chase down that head kick. He threw it, it landed, and he almost got the finish. All right, next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good back and forth action in the previous round. Yes, it wasn't a bar fight. It wasn't two guys throwing the kitchen sink at each other. But you did see times when it came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Nice 
big body kick. Look at the turnover in that kick. Liver kick. Nice job with that follow-up shot as well. Lee's got a big bruise starting to form on the right side of his body. Huge block there. Nice. Turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Uppercut lands. Oh, big head kick. Oh, he landed that knee to the midsection. Got to think his opponent's going to feel that one in the morning. And he's going to continue to throw that strike because he knows that his opponent can't take many of them. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Beautiful leg kick thrown. All right, less than three minutes to go here in round number four. Oh, big head kick land. Nice punch lands. Right hand upstairs. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Well, he's got to be on top of the world, dominating this fight. The stamina still on point. He didn't skip those versa climber days, that's for sure. No, this has to feel good. This has to feel like everything we did in training camp has worked to perfection. Look for him to try to replicate that before his next fight. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Sound defensively blocks the shot. Let's go, guys, work! Just misses with a left hook there. Blocks the strike. shot there. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. All right, less than a minute here to go in our fourth round. Way to hide that leg kick. Punch coming, it's blocked. Big kick lands. Superman punch. Right hand on point. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Back to the jab now. No good. Twenty seconds now remain in the round. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times you will block the shot. That's income. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on.
All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Oh, big punch lands. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got a hurt bad. He's just being more aggressive, and because he's being more aggressive and more loose with his strikes, he's landed. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Oh, you can feel the breeze there. Swing and a miss by Lee. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Big punch land. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. Let's go. All right, well, time is the enemy now, DC, and he's really running out of it if he's going to get his hand raised tonight. He's got to go forward. He's got to just throw everything at his opponent to try and find that punch or that kick that's going to end the fight. There is no time for strategy anymore. Big kick land. Beautiful body kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. Two minutes now to go in this one. Big kick. So he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strokes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Oh, nice right hand. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. Well, he gets up again here, but he looks hurt. What a punch. Punch is blocked. Kick. One minute to go in the fight. Just missed with the left there. 45 seconds remain in the round. Now a knee to the body. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Big left hook coming, it's blocked. 20 seconds to go in the fight. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. Uh, you are battering that nose. I mean, 
look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. All right, so the fight goes the distance. We'll take a look back at the action, but should go his way given all he got done in the striking game. Yeah, he did a great job of landing at will, mixing up the target, doing everything that he's become known for in order to cruise to a very good decision. I know he didn't get the finish that he wanted so bad coming in here tonight, but he had a phenomenal performance, and he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the world. We'll see how the judges saw it. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 50-45, 49-46, and 50-45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee!